Nosha Teen was handed a life sentence for murdering 15-year-old Kaylee Duga over two years ago. Stephanie Haynes live at the Kenosha County Courthouse with more about an emotional day in court. Stephanie. Carol, indeed, Kaylee Juga's mother, Stephanie, spoke and the court listened. The judge gave Martise Fuller a life sentence. He just turned 18 a few days ago, and now he'll spend the rest of his life in prison. On this day, two years ago, 15-year-old Kaylee Juga was laid to rest. And on Friday in Kenosha County Court, Kaylee's mother, Stephanie, shared how unimaginable the loss has been. Whether we were shopping, going to the gym, going to Starbucks, watching Netflix, jamming in the car to music, or just dancing like crazy in the kitchen. She was always by my side, and she was my biggest cheerleader. Now I'm lost. In March, a jury convicted Martise Fuller for murdering Kaylee, shooting Stephanie, and breaking into the Juga home. Fuller was 15 at the time, and he has been in jail ever since. Fuller sat expressionless in court while District Attorney Michael Gravely showed his emotion. There is no ability for Stephanie Juga to heal until this defendant is in prison forever. Fuller's attorney asked the court for the possibility of extended supervision in 25 to 30 years. To give someone who is 18 years old some ability to think that one day they may be able to walk in the world to do something, a small thing to make up for the tremendous pain and sorrow. Finally, Fuller prepared a written statement that an attorney read on his behalf. Fuller apologized and without any explanation said he maintains his innocence. But I have to continue to stand innocent because I am. And I know that I've barely showed emotion throughout my time but in all honesty, it is because it's hard to have tears left to cry knowing my mom lost a son, one of her children too. Then the judge handed Fuller his sentence. The court has no trust whatsoever that what brought you to this murder and attempted murder is repaired or repairable ever. Then the families walked out, hugging and in silence. Stephanie Juga then put on a shirt that reads, Kaylee Strong. The families and the attorneys left without making any further statements. And by the way, the judge did sentence Martise for shooting Stephanie Juga and breaking into their home. Those sentences will be served after his life sentence. Live in Kenosha, Stephanie Haynes, TMJ4 News. Uh, just heartbreaking all the way around. Stephanie, thank you very much. Digging deeper, last month, the U.S. Supreme Court banned mandatory life without parole sentences for juveniles, saying judges should consider the age of offenders when they sentence cases. Now, according to the Wisconsin Department of Corrections, 112 people are serving life terms for crimes they committed as a juvenile. The I-team found the average age of a teen sentenced to life is 15.8 years. They're not eligible for parole until they've served more than 38 years in prison. And you can watch the I-Team story on juvenile offenders and hear from victim advocates, also psychologists. Just go to TMJ4.com and search juvenile offender.